All right, guys. So I really love when people do grocery unhauls. So I'm going to attempt to do my Costco unhaul for you while Cal puts magnets on the dishwasher right there. Can you see the little head? There it is. Okay. So first up, I got two things of vital protein, one for my in-laws and one for us. Super cheap at Costco. So one of my favorite things to get. I love to put collagen in my coffee in the morning all the time, but I also use it in my smoothies for a smoothie box. Although sometimes I order collagen through them too. So anyways, moving along. Got some feta because after having my Starbucks feta wraps the other day, I decided I needed 50,000 more of those in my life and more feta in my life. So there's that. Every once in a while we get these Teton water uh, grass fed beef hot dogs. They're super delicious. I don't get them every time. They're not like a staple, but definitely something to get. Um, I'm living on the wild side, friends, with some romaine lettuce. I really want to make a taco salad this week, so uh, I think that romaine lettuce is the way to go. So living on the edge. Hopefully it doesn't get recalled. There's that. We get spinach, a ton of it every week. Mr. Hungry likes to make these drinks that are literally like spinach, collagen, and stevia drop. It's so roadie, but he likes them and he gets it a ton of vegetables, so there's that. I also put spinach in with my smoothie box smoothies or daily harvest when we have those. Um, and then I got, okay, this one is unexpected. I'm not gonna lie, this is shopping with the toddlers. So I got three things of <laughs> three salad kits. <laughs> We don't even usually use the dressing with them, but um, they're just so easy and I don't know, I got three of them. I don't usually get three of them, but there's that. I go shopping once a week, just so you know, and I usually rotate between three stores. So I'll go to Trader Joe's one week and then Sprouts next week and then Costco the following week and then I start all over again. So that's kind of how I do things. <laughs> So just so you know, so this, these, all these groceries are lasting me while well, obviously it's Costco, so they're going to last beyond next week, but they're going to, um, last for quite some time. A big bag of broccoli to roast. So one of these salad packs will go in Mr. Hungry's lunch next, next week, or maybe he'll do some broccoli. I've got cod planned to go in his lunch. I did not buy any cod from Costco, although I usually do buy my cod from Costco right now anyway. And, um... But I have some in the fridge or the freezer from a few weeks ago. I got a ton, giant thing of hummus because we've been obsessed with it. The baby's obsessed with it. Although I don't give them a lot because obviously high sodium. But um, this one's actually not too bad. So that's good. Uh, this is the Oasis brand. I usually like their three pack because then you can like open them at separate times. But I didn't see that. So there's that. Uh, got some Kerrygold butter. I think grass-fed butter is super, super important because grass-fed dairy in general is going to have more omega-3s and antioxidants, and a lot of that is found in the fat, so it's really important. And then I got a ton of organic guacamole. It's supposed to be good through March, so I should have some time to knock down this guacamole. I'm totally in like a taco salad craving mood. So I'm also going to put, I'm going to eat the orange and yellow out. Uh, bell peppers I will chop up for snacks and then the red ones I'll use in my paleo taco salad recipe and then I got these to try probably for dinner tonight they're organic paleo tomato and basil chicken meatballs I didn't really love this this brand's um paleo like basil something sausage so We'll see how these are because I like other sausages from this brand. I just didn't really love the paleo sausage they had, but maybe the paleo meatballs would be better. I don't know. And then I dumped half of a container of organic blueberries. Cool, $7 organic blueberries in the parking lot because of the way the person packed it, but it's fine. But the rest are here and it's like literally the only fruit little man will consistently eat. So there's that. Other things I put away in the fridge and I will share pictures of next are... Or gain protein shakes. Now that I can do dairy again, since I'm not breastfeeding an MSPI baby anymore, I did switch to the whey protein shakes instead of the plant-based ones. And the reason I did that was not because I like really craved whey or anything. I actually wanted to stick with the plant-based ones because why not? But actually they have um, nine milligrams of iron in the plant-based ones. And I have a prenatal that I still take. Oh, I'm not pregnant. 
not planning on it, but I take my prenatal and that has, that has, um, actually look, it has quite a bit of iron in it. 27 milligrams. The upper limit's 40. So if you had 27 plus nine, like you're kind of starting to get up there. And, um, so I just didn't want that anymore. And so I switched to the whey protein shakes because luckily I can do dairy now. I think all that extra iron was fine. Like while I was breastfeeding and needed to be dairy free. Yeah, this is a safe toy. <laughs> Got these out of his drawers. Um, but now not so much. I also got unsweetened vanilla almond milk and cauliflower pizza crust and some bread, some Dave's Killer flax and honey bread. And the reason I get the flax and honey is because I think the seeded one that they sell there is too many seeds for little dude. So um, I don't wanna get the white bread. So I settle on the flax and honey. I really like their sprouted bread version, but they don't have that at Costco yet. And what else do we get? Diapers. Oh, and I just remembered I got eggs and they're sitting on the driver's seat of the car because those also fell on the ground, but luckily did not break. So I need to go get those out of the driver's seat of the car. So I'm done with this. Let me know if you like this grocery unhauling video or if it was boring or what, just be brutally honest. And um, that way I know whether to do them or not. Do them anymore or not. My arms are cut off, I look weird. Okay, have a great day guys, bye.